Newport Beach, California. With its stretches of white sand, beautiful people, and great outdoor water sports, this Orange County Beach community makes a great California vacation. Whether you're into sunbathing or shopping, cycling or surfing, this town has it and more. I grew up about seven miles from Newport Beach, so I guess you could say this was my high school hangout. Back then I spent most of my time at 32nd Street and Balboa Fun Zone, but today, let's explore the city. Veronica Hill, your California travel expert. Let's pack our beach bags and hit the boardwalk in search of good food and fun in Newport Beach. For a vacation just steps from the sand, check into Newport Beach hotels like Doryman's Inn, Newport Beach Walk Hotel, or Balboa Inn, where you can almost taste the salt water. From here, you can walk to most Newport Beach attractions and restaurants. Many Newport Beach homes are also available as vacation rentals, and some have ocean views. Newport Beach travel is great any time of the year, but the best time to visit is during the summer. You can stroll along the boardwalk, play a game of volleyball on the beach, or body surf the Wedge, a world famous surfing spot at the end of Balboa Peninsula. For kinder, gentler water, check out Newport Dunes where you can go paddle surfing or rent a pedal boat. This is a great place to stay if you have an RV and cottages are also available overnight. On the weekends, you can watch fishermen bring in the catch of the day at Dory Fleet Market along Newport Pier. The boats usually arrive between 7 and 9 a.m. when the buying frenzy begins. Seafood lovers line up early to get their hands on fresh fish like sea trout, urchin, and live stone crab. Though seafood is hot, it's not the only kind of cuisine in town. Newport Beach restaurants range from the elegant 21 Ocean Front, known for its great filet mignon, to the casual Charlie's Chili, which is famous for its all-day breakfast. The historic crab cooker is known for its amazing cracked crab, served with cheesy potatoes and fisherman's bread. They're also famous for their Manhattan clam chowder, passed down through generations. Get here early, as this has been a local's favorite since 1951. Balboa Pier is home to the very first Ruby's Diner, which opened in 1982. This is a great spot to chow down on crisp fish and chips or Kobe beef sliders while enjoying gorgeous views of the Pacific. Balboa, home to the famous Balboa Bar and Old Fashioned Fun Zone, is a great place to spend the afternoon. This coastal amusement park is one of California's oldest, dating back to 1936. Here you'll find a ton of things to do, from a great Ferris wheel and festive merry-go-round to the Kids at Heart Bungee Jumper. In the Bay Arcade, you can play a round of air hockey or skee ball. Balboa Pavilion dates back to 1906. Today it's a popular marine recreation center. This is the place to pick up a whale watching cruise, go on a sport fishing tour, or take the morning ride to Catalina Island aboard the Catalina Flyer. The Fun Zone Boat Company offers hourly tours through Newport Bay, or you can charter your own little duffy boat through Balboa Boat Rentals. At Paddle Power, you can rent a kayak or outrigger canoe. Balboa Island, accessible by ferry from Balboa Peninsula, is a quaint seaside community filled with dozens of fun boutiques and restaurants. But its main claim to fame is the Balboa Bar and Frozen Chocolate Banana, which were invented here around 1945. Another great Newport Beach attraction is Crystal Cove State Park, a 1930s beach resort that's perfect for kite flying, tide pool exploring, and plein air painting. It's a great place to start or end a Newport Beach vacation. For more California travel videos, advice, and tips, log on to CaliforniaTravelExpert.com.